guys, today I have a new update for my whole collection project pan and we have a lot to roll out. Um, we only have four items left, so we're rolling out six items today, which means we get to roll in six more, which is crazy. I haven't had this much progress in a long time. So we are just going to go down order the order of my list. Um, so we'll probably bounce back and forth between things that are staying and things that are rolling out. But for this project, I am using everything for 30 uses. Um, unless I hit pan first, then I will roll it out then. But for the most part, everything is going to be used 30 times. So let's just get right into it. First, we have my blush. And this is the Caitlyn Jenner and MAC blush in the shade Buddy. And this is what it looked like last time. And here is what it's looking like today. It's probably going to look exactly the same because these blushes, these MAC blushes are so hard pressed that like you're not going to see any progress. But I previously used this seven times and now we are at 20 times. So we use this quite a bit. I have 10 more to go and I think I can definitely roll this out for next update. The next product that I have is from AOA Studio and this is my liquid lipstick in the shade Faded. And previously we had used this 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18 times. And now we have finally used this for our 30 uses. So this one will be rolling out. Um, it's not settled at this point, but when I let it settle a while ago, it was like way down to here. So like, that's pretty exciting. Like I'm glad to get use out of this, but I'm ready to put this one away. It was hard to work with. I had to mix this with a whole bunch of different things just for it to look normal to wear on the daily basis. So I'm ready for this one to get put away. Next, we have my e.l.f. bronzer, which it's actually, I've categorized it now as a highlighter in my collection, but it is called the e.l.f. The, the e.l.f. Healthy Glow Bronzer. And this is what it looked like before. And this is what it's looking like today. So lots of brush marks, tiny little dip, but mostly I wore away the imprint that was on here, which is pretty a pretty good like usage goal, I guess. And I feel good about it. I definitely got some good use out of this one. And previously I had used this 20 times, so I had to use this 10 more times for this one to roll out, and it is rolling out this update as well. I forgot to swatch the blush. So here is the blush mixed with the matte and the shimmer together. Most of the time that's what I do, but uh, sometimes I just go for the matte side. So there is the MAC blush. Okay, back to where we were. My next product is my eyeshadow from Fiona Styles, and we're working on the dark purple shade. And this is what it looked like before. This is what it is looking like today. It is obviously that purple shade with the little dip. And just, I mean, yeah, it's just a little dip. There's not much more to say about it. But I only had to use this five more times to roll it out this month. So I did do that. I used it five more times for a total of 30 and it's getting rolled out. I think I wore this, I wore this mostly on the lower lash line a few times like in the outer corner, but mostly the lower lash line but this one is also getting rolled out. The next item is actually my lip liner, and this is the Palladio Lip Liner in the shade Nutmeg. And last time I had wore this eight times, and now we are at 5, 10, 15, 19 uses. Uh, I should have put this on today so it would be an even 20, but I guess I did not. Um, so we're at 19 uses. I think that's what 11 more uses. I should be able to roll this out for next month. 
and here is what this color looks like it's like a nice terracotta orange um, but I just kind of use it lightly and then with those nude lipsticks liquid lipsticks that I have been trying to use um, it gave them a little bit more color so I liked using them together and here is what it looks like on the paper so the red part is what we used this month the blue up here is what we used last month so just a little bit but progress is progress the next item is my Blink Go Glow Gitter Face Palette, and we're working on the shade Empowered. So this is what it looked like before. And this is what it's looking like today. So it is this shade down here. You can tell it's definitely been worn quite a bit. It's been loved. And I really like this shade. I like this palette in general. I had to use this for my Project 5 uses this month. So I wore all of the shades in this palette, but obviously I wore Empowered a ton. So I really like that one. But yeah, just some brush strokes. Not much, not much else. Um, but last time we had used this 20 times, so I had to use this 10 more times, this update to roll it out. And it is getting rolled out this update as well. Lots of stuff rolling out. Okay, next we have the Too Faced Coco Contour Palette. And we are working on the shade Medium Mocha. So this is what it looked like last time. And this is what it's looking like today. So it's this bronzer shade down here. Um, I can see like overall like usage on it, nothing like outstanding or anything, but I definitely have used it. Um, last time, again, I was at 20 uses, I had to use it 10 more times, and I did. So I'm at 30 uses with this guy. This one is also rolling out. Next, we have a cream eyeshadow, and this is my Kylie Cosmetics eyeshadow in the shade Camo. So this is what it looked like when I rolled it in last time. And here's what it's looking like today. I actually have like a really good dip in here. It's kind of drying out, so it, it's kind of flaky, but I've been using this on the lower lash line and I've been using a brush, so I think that's why I'm getting more of a dip. Um, I'm currently at 10 uses. So honestly, with 20 more uses, I feel like I might be able to hit pan, but I doubt it. So I'm not like banking on hitting pan on this one, but I think it's possible. So we're just gonna keep using this one. I do really like it on the lower lash line. I haven't tried it anywhere else, um, but yeah. Oh, let's do a swatch of this one because it's staying in. As soon as you swatch it, it makes the dip look smaller. I should have filmed close-ups before before I swatched them. But here is that color. It's kind of like a mossy, greenish, brownish gold. It's kind of an ugly color, but it looks pretty on your eyes. The next product I also rolled in last update, and this is the NYX Liquid Lingerie Liquid Lipstick in the shade Exotic. And here's what it's looking like. And we are currently at 13 uses on this one. I've been wearing this like pretty much like every day that I was wearing lip color. It matches like pretty perfectly with that lip liner. So this one's nice like for the holidays and stuff um, or filming, but on the every day, I've just been putting a few dots on and mixing it with a nude so that it's more wearable for like the everyday, but it's all right. I don't love this packaging. I don't know why. I feel like the stopper is just way too big because like nothing comes on the wand. So, I mean, you can see the product, like it's clear packaging. So I don't know. It's just kind of weird. You don't get like barely any product on the stopper. So I don't know. I feel like I might have to take the stopper out and like mix it around and then put it back in. But I don't know. It's still working okay enough now, but these will be annoying to try to completely use up. 
that I ever try to do that. Okay, we have one last product, and that is my big Simply Pleasures eyeshadow palette. We were working on shade number 94, and this is what it looked like last time. And here's what it's looking like today. It is this navy blue up here, and we hit pan on it. Yay! I was using this as an eyeliner to hit pan, and I had to use this 13 times in order to get there. This palette actually isn't going to be going anywhere because I just rolled in a shade to my panel's eyeshadows from here. Um, and I have big plans for this palette next year as well. So we're going to be seeing a lot more of this palette in the future. Okay, it is time to roll in some new items. I think my phone is somewhat charged. So we have to roll in six more items, which is like m most of the project, right? Three, five, six, nine, 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 nine. So what I do when I'm rolling things in, I only like to have a max of two items per, per category. Um, so I already have one blush, so I can roll in one more, but that's it. Um, nothing is already off limits, so we will see what we get. All right, let's do it. 1096. All right, we have an eyeshadow. This is a single eyeshadow because it's depotted. It's from the Morty the Morphe 35T palette. So we have one powdered eyeshadow. We can only do one more powder eyeshadow. All right. And we got our second powdered eyeshadow. This is the Bad, ha Bad Habit Solstice palette in the shade Summer. Okay, so that's it for powdered eyeshadow eyeshadow. If I roll in another one, I will have to skip forward. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this was in my whole collection project pan, like last update, I think. This is the Becca and Barbie Ferrera Prismatic Face Palette in the shade Hustle. Is that the same color? No, it's a different color, so that's good. And those are cream highlighters or cream blushes. Uh, it depends on the shade. Let's pick another. Ooh, okay. How many do we have totaled already? Okay, so this is our eighth item. This is from my lipstick palette, and this was in my um, Roulette Pan collab, and it's shade number 20. I have no idea what that's going to be. That's kind of a good one. All right, I think two more. Ooh, an old one. That's another eyeshadow. I'm actually panning that in my Build Your Own palette anyways. Okay. That's another eyeshadow. Okay, we got another liquid lipstick. Where is it? This is the ABH liquid lipstick in stripped. We're getting some hard things. <laughs> Actually, we're, I don't know if they're gonna be hard, but we're getting like a good mixture. One more item. Hmm. This is a mascara. Last time I did do the mascara, um, because I only had two open, but now I have three open, so I don't want to pull in another mascara yet, so I guess we'll skip that. Oh, 
Okay, we got a liquid eyeshadow. We can do that. It's the shade Thermo. Interesting. Okay. I am going to go find everything and I will be right back. Okay, we're back. We have um, some interesting items rolling in. This is gonna be hard. Okay, let's start off. First, we had the Morphe 35T eyeshadow in the shade number 30 shade. This is just a super easy coppery brown. This one's normal. This is a normal one, okay. It's kind of like a rose gold. It's really pretty. I like that one. And I think that will go pretty well with my Panos eyeshadows. Next, we pulled out my Bad Habit Solstice palette in the shade Summer. And, all right, here's the palette. It's a dupe for the, ooh, one of the Natasha Denona palettes. Uh, Summer. Summer is the yellow, definitely not for this time of year, but we'll make it work. Um, I'm probably going to like just pull the shade out of here and put it in my magnetic palette. That way there's less space in my desk uh, or more space in my desk, but there's the yellow. It's definitely very pigmented. Interesting. Okay, next. Next, we pulled out the Barbie and Ferrera, or is that what it is? Yeah, the Barbie Ferrera and Becca palette, and we got the shade Hustle, which is the purple. So, <laughs> it is this shade right here. It's a cream product. It's supposed to be a cream highlighter. And there that is right there. It's got a little duochrome in it. I think I'll probably use that as an eyeshadow. I do think I tried it as a cream blush like once and it was for filming. It was okay. I didn't love it, but eek. <sighs> yeah, I'll use that as an eyeshadow as well. So we now have this palette. Another good one. <laughs> Okay, next we have my lipstick palette and we have shade number 20. I haven't looked at this one yet. So when I put it in my spreadsheet, I started with the green as number one. So we'll count down to number 20. Okay, this one's doable. It is this brown nude right here. And this I will probably pop out into one of my other palettes as well. That way I can put it in, not have the whole palette in. But there's that right there at the bottom. That's a good one. I can do that. I am really trying to finish off some lipsticks right now though. Um, but that's okay. We'll make that one work. Two more items. We have ABH Liquid Lipstick in the shade Stripped which is this one, another very light nude shade. This is like honestly pretty identical to the AOA shade that just rolled out, except it's more pink and less brown. So I do like this one. I think this one will be really nice for the everyday. Um, and I do think this one will mix well with Exotica. So I like this one. I also am trying to use up um, ColourPop Strip, so now I rolled in ABH Stripped with a T, and they are very similar. This one's just a little darker, but we'll see. I might probably just mix them all together, I guess. And then the last item I rolled in is a liquid eyeshadow from Shop Miss A in the shade Thermo. So many eyeshadows and lip products, like, this is crazy. kind of drying out a little but there it is right here up top it is just 
really icy, light, slightly pink champagne, I guess. It's just the slightest of pink. It looks more pink in the tube than it does swatched out. Um, all right, we will use this one as well. Guys, I think all of these roll-ins are going to take me quite a while. Like these, it's pretty summery, I would say, for the winter. Slightly nervous, but this project also does not have an end date. Kind of like I was mentioning in my Pamela's eyeshadows. I don't know which one will go up first, but both of those, this project and the Pamela's eyeshadows, I don't have an end date. So if I don't have to, like if I have something else that I need to focus on more, like that is finishing up this month, then I will. So we'll see what we have for progress next time. <sighs> These are some hard products. I think, what do I think? Let's go back a page on my paper. I need to use Mac Buddy 10 more times. I think I can definitely do that. And then whew, my Palladial Lip Liner, I think I need 11 more times. That should be pretty easy as well. And then I'm not entirely sure, oops, I dropped the lip, liquid lipstick, but the um, Kylie Camels at 10 uses, I have to use that 20 more times. I don't think I'll have that one rolled out. And then the NYX liquid lipstick that I just dropped is at 13. I don't think I'll have that one rolled out either. So for next update, we're looking at two rollouts and then that's probably it. Unless I can hit pan on that Morphe eyeshadow. If I can hit pan on this one, then this one can roll out. But um, that's going to be it. I'm, I guess if I hit pan on this lipstick, that can count too. But these pans are super deep. Like, I'll take this one out that's at the bottom. Like, that's how deep they are. Like, I'm not going to hit pan on this. So, hmm. these products are going to be in here for a while. I'm a little nervous. Can you tell? Okay. I hope you guys liked this video and definitely like, comment, and subscribe down below for more and I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye guys.